Welcome back everyone, you're watching Sports Gear Reviews with Sean and today I have the Messi 15.2 Firm Ground AG Shoe to review. So here's the box. This comes in the Messi variation box. There's a lock on the top if I open it up. All you get inside the box are the shoes. Let's take this out quickly. Now, this is a US 9 size. This weighs 9 ounces, which is equivalent to 256 grams. It has a synthetic upper. The main synthetic material on the shoe expands from here on the lateral side, goes all the way through on the front of the shoe, and then the same cut point on the medial side. The synthetic material on Messi 15.2 is not the Messi touch that you find on 15.1. The synthetic on 15.2 is a bit thinner. It's pretty soft and flexible. Now, moving on to the tongue. The tongue is made up of some kind of foam base, as you can see. Now, I would have preferred it being the same synthetic material. The laces run through the middle of the shoe. Moving on to the back side, this is the messy frame which is a lot different from the top end model. It is a fused on cage which helps support the heel part when you put on the laces tie. So now let's have a quick look at the insole. This is a basic insole, mesh liner on the top, a single layer of foam. Nothing specific about it but gets the work done. Now, Moving on to the outsole of the Messi 15.2. This is the Messi Gamma Tracks stud pattern as they call it. It looks similar to the 15.1 outsole but it is not. The base here is just hard plastic and this is all one piece. So it looks like it has cutouts but it is not. This is a firm ground AG stud pattern by Adidas. Now the studs are triangular in shape as you can see but the two in the front and two in the back are circular in shape. This is not a lightweight shoe, it's a bit heavier as it feels, it's 9 ounces. So this is all spec about the shoe, let's see how it performs on the field. This is the front, side and back view of the shoe on feet. The synthetic material of the shoe helps in making good contact with the ball while juggling, passing and dribbling the ball on the ground. While shooting the ball, the contact with the ball was amazing as the messy cage helps locking the feet very well, giving you a firm grip and stability while shooting the ball. So the final wording for Messi 15.2 is that if you're looking for a shoe that has a slimmer profile and you don't much worry about the weight, then this can be the shoe for you. Thank you for watching the video. I'll see you later with more product reviews.